It's less than four weeks before I start my Appalachian through hike, and I'm starting to fine tune the clothes that I'll be taking with me. The first set of clothes that I'm going to show you is the, the, the clothes that are dedicated to camp as camp clothes. Uh, the first thing is uh, there, I have a heavy pair of wool socks. I'm not really even sure of the manufacturer of these socks. All I know is that they are heavy, heavy warm socks. Um, the next thing I'll, uh, I want to show you is the, uh, I have a pair of real soft fleece sweatpants. Uh, these are Under Armour pants. They're super comfortable. Uh, that's why I like to wear them. They're uh, really soft and, and warm. Uh, I do have, uh, the underwear that I wear is uh, called Head Performance Underwear. Nothing special about it. They're um, uh, polyester uh, spandex blend. You can get them at Walmart, Kmart, wherever. What difference does it make? What, what, what difference does it make where you buy underwear? Hey. Next thing I have is a top. This top is just is a. It's made by it's it's. I've had this for a, a long time. It's uh it's the tag says Ultra Therm. Uh, I don't even know. If, I've never even. I don't know if you can even find them anymore. But it's uh, it's also it's a wool a wool and polyester blend, and it's uh it's it it feels almost like uh, the cut the old cotton thermal underwear. Uh, and it's and it's and it's a warm, nice warm layer to have on. And as a top layer, I have uh, I have this from REI. It's a, it's just a light, it's just a light uh, polyester spandex top. That's uh, that's a hoodie. And as I said, I just got it from from REI. Next, for a base layer, I have a smart wool bottom, and I also have uh, the smart wool top. The, the smart wool top I, is, uh, is a three-quarter zip, and they're both the heavier smart wool. They're the Merino 250, uh, just because I'm not sure what kind of temperatures we'll run into, and uh, if it's not if it's not that cold, I, I just may not go with that. I may use these uh, at night for camp wear. The socks I have uh, are darn tough socks. I have two pair. I'll uh, change those out every day uh, or actually just rotate them every day along with my Injinji uh, toe socks. The, I wanted to show you that um, the Appalachian Trail Conservancy has these socks. These are the 2022 edition. You can buy these online. Uh, I'm really excited about wearing these for the start and for the finish of the trail. And next I have a, a neck gaiter. Neck gaiter, it's uh, just to, of course, cover my neck, up over my ears, nose, just had my eyes showing. Uh, and on top of my head, I have uh, a smart wool beanie. So moving on to mid layer or mid layers, multiple mid layers. Uh, the first thing I'll, I have here is a, uh, a Nike dry fit uh, long sleeve running shirt. The, uh, the next thing I have is a uh, Patagonia snap snap three quarter lightweight fleece and finally i have a uh, a hoodie that uh, that i got it uh, oh gosh i got it on a on sale at uh, united by blue i don't know what the material is but it's very breathable really warm um, i i wear it a lot And for my top layer, if it's if it's warm out, I'm, I've got a pair of REI shorts that are just that have the built-in liner, and they're lightweight, breathable, stretchy, uh, just really comfortable to wear. 
If it's colder out, I have a pair of pair of pants that are made by Cool. I really, really like these pants a lot. They're, they're stretchy. They've got uh, multiple zipper pockets. They have um, a, nice, a nice waistband that's, that's really comfortable. They also have a, uh, a zipper down at the bottom that accommodate you know, any kind of boots. And also, also a little clip little clip at the bottom to clip onto the front of your your shoe or boot whatever to uh, kind of act like a gator but these are these are they, I, I love these pants uh, and then next I have my of course my Patagonia puffy jacket that everybody everybody seems to have a puffy jacket but I like I like the Patagonia So the gloves I'm bringing are Marmot. Uh, I put a fleece liner in them just for a little bit more warmth. I also have a for rain gear. I have a I have an REI Gore-Tex rain gear top. I don't think I'll be wearing the bottoms because the pants that I have are pretty water resistant. Um, and if they do get wet, they, they, they will dry out real easy. But, uh, I like this, I like this rain gear. It also has a little brim on the top here that'll, that, uh, will accommodate my hat. That, my hat that I'll wear <laughs> is, that my daughter named my adventure hat that I wear eh, everywhere. So yeah, it's it's my go-to hat. It's comfortable. It fits great. Um, I, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, until the next time, I hope to get another video out before I before I hit the trail. Um, see you. See if not, I'll see you on the trail.